Trip vacations can cost money. You got gas and time, but how about a staycation? That way you don't have to travel very far. Camille Williams in studio with some tips on how you can save on day trips. I love taking road trips and I've done a few since I moved to Macon, but how about places to go right here in the heart of Georgia? No matter where you live in central Georgia, you can always find something right here in Macon from music to art to the county's natural wonders. Without having to break the bank, where can you go on day trips to Macon? Tip number one, visit the Okmulgee Mounds National Historic Park. This Native American site has a museum in eight miles of natural beauty. Plus, it doesn't cost a thing, or as I like to say, free 99. Tip number two, check out Golden Bow Bookstore. It's on Cotton Avenue, which was the hub for black businesses during the Jim Crow era. It's locally owned and you'll find rare reads inside and outside. Tip number three, take a stroll down Ingleside Village. You don't have to buy anything, but there are some unusual places to visit. Nancy Marshall just moved to Macon and comes to Ingleside often. Went from the paint store to the hardware store to the cheesecake store, to the antique store, to, you know, the art store. I have had such a great time. It was near Christmas. I couldn't believe the atmosphere. Three great places with incredible back stories. In our 5.30 show, I will tell you about three more places you can go without breaking the bank. Back to you. I like it. Thanks, Camila. You can find more must-see places on our website at 13WMAZ.com.